Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Make it a great night, folks. Be impeccable with your word. Manifest your true intentions. Regardless of what language you speak, your intent will be manifested through the word. What you dream, what you feel, and what you really are will be manifested through what you say each and every day. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 205, Nasdaq's down 57, SP's up 2.5, gold contract down $6.40, trading at 1791 an ounce. We got silver down 18 cents. $20, $0.22 an ounce, light sweet crude. That's getting whacked out here today, down $3.24, $86.17 a barrel, notes and bonds. You get the 10-year note, down 10 ticks, trading one nineteen twelve. The 30-year off nine at one forty one zero eight. and King Dollar. King Dollar right now trading down 60 ticks, 106.486. The Euro is 101. The yen is at 134, and the British pound is at 120 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world, in the world of the S&Ps. Let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, it's going to be a cool little market, a cool little 60 minutes here, folks. So first, let me bring, I'm going to bring up the E-minis and the future contracts so you can kind of see how this is shaking out here. So. We bring this up intraday for a couple days. What you're going to see, and this is a classic, man. This is, well, this is a classic, folks, when you are going to go downtown and you're going to go downtown very quickly, okay? And what it is is this, is that what, I, what I've seen is this, is that when markets get stretched, most of the time what happens on a larger correction is kind of what we just seen today, like right now. Um, and what it is, is this. First they get stretched, then they get stretched more, then they get stretched more, and then intraday what happens is that they get stretched and they blow every shot out of the water. Meaning you accelerate up, you get a nice acceleration up on the S&P, what we just did on this last acceleration, we went from 42.78, okay, to 43.27, and I'm going to bring this back so you can see that there was nothing at the, the, the top bar. See that top one? The top one had uh, 23,000 contracts. Then what ends up happening, it's like, okay, the next little bar had 18, and then here you go. Bingo, 36,000 contracts and 54,000 contracts. We hit the low at 54,000 contracts. So. More than likely, you're setting up an intraday ABC structure on the way down. Now, let me put this on the NQ so I can show you on the NQs. So the NQs did the same thing and actually were actually more deviant uh, because what you did, first you went down and you went down good, okay? You know, we got first we got down to a price point of 13522 It goes up, 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 blows it away, man gets up there now watch this man you love markets man and then look at that so 9,000 contracts was at the high the first bar off the high 7,900 and here you go here we go the next one 16,000 the next one 19,000 this baby is going south man and We'll see what it's going to do in ABC down today. It has plenty of time to do that ABC down. The thing that's amazing, so, so picture, when this was happening, the, I'm looking, I'm saying to myself, I was just, I was so picture this, I'm saying to Tommy, I can't believe this, man. Right, you know, we're sitting out there trading, he's trading, I'm trading, we're, I'm writing a press release at the same time. And, and so what happens, right, when this happens is that when it goes fast and furious like this on the way down, after a stretch like it is, it catches a lot of folks, you know, because what ends up happening, you either close the positions or you flip the positions. And then, and, and, and my point more than anything is this, and then you can't find nothing why the sell off is there. That's the first thing I went to. I says, okay, man, what, what's going on? Well, there's nothing going on, folks. What it is, is the bottom line is that the selling. 
You know, so we'll see where this baby shakes out. But this is telling me that this next, uh, you know, 50 minutes, we're going to be going south. So let's go over to the gold contract. Look at the gold contract. They say, look at the gold contract. You're down $6.40. Uh, each and every day, the bottom line is that it's been rejecting lower prices. It has tremendously lighter volume, but guess what? It's not going higher, man. It's still going sideways, okay? Now, we only have 88,000 contracts. So that is saying flat out that, yeah, you don't have sellers. Well, we need buyers. And right now, you still don't have buyers. We go into the note and bond market. We take a look at the note and bond market. Right now, you have the 10-year the is down 10 ticks. You know, this has got highly volatile, there's no doubt about it. This also looks like, now you talk about deviant, this also only has uh, 82,000 contracts today. No, 828,000 contracts today. Now watch this. This is really light contract volume for a pullback. I mean, look at this. You're pulling, you, you know, you went higher with uh, 1.6 million, you're actually going into 1.7 million, and you're only doing 828,000. That's a setup that it still wants higher price. That's, a, that's how this thing is set up. Then we get into the good old King Dollar, because King Dollar, uh, bottom line, where are you, King Dollar, there it is, okay. So what we have with King Dollar is that King Dollar had broken hard last week, came right back inside. Oh, it, it decided that, hey man, you know, it, it, what it had done, it basically had broken the trend line, channel line rather, channel line, got right up above it again, and now what just happened is just gave it up again. So this is going to be really cool, man. Uh, you know, it's a great, great trade market, number one. And we'll see where this baby shake is, uh, shakes out. Um, you get both sides going. So the divergence still is, if that dollar can get lower, we'll see that market higher. Not today. I'm not talking about today. Today, my take is that we're going to sell down because of the way that we just went through this whole deal. Our, our phone number is 877-927-6648. Dow's up 191. Nasdaq's down 62. S&P's a flat. We'll come right back.